Hi guys, welcome back. So today in this lecture, will we discuss about how to use a dependent pick list by a screen flow. So let's take an example and elaborate how to do this. Okay, I have an account object. When I click on this, so see here I have an account object. Okay, in the account object, see when I click on new. see here is a unit when i select audi its dependent pick list will be audi delhi and kolkata when i select bharat bench the dependent pick list will be bharat bench agra aligarh faridabad gajabad muzaffarnagar when i select renault it will be like renault motigar pratapgar and zaiwadabad and tota simply for tota delhi greater noida and noida after this the tota fml and it will be tota bhuneshwar katak roll Tota Rolikela and Tota Sambalpur. So this is how a dependent pick list work in a Salesforce org. I want this dependent pick list work in a screen flow. How to do this? Okay. How the dependent pick list work in a screen flow? So let's quickly create a dependent pick list in a screen flow. I have to go to my setup object and. Uh, In the quick find box, I search flow. Go to click on this flow. Click to new flow. Start from scratch. Click next. Screen flow. Click create. Okay. So in the add element plus button, click interaction is screen flow. Click on this. In this component, search dependent pick list here. Drag the component from here to here and depend use of so depend label it name as first dependent dent okay so in the dependent pick list first is the api name okay and what you name as a api name so api name would be your anything that take unit as a api name okay firstly object api name the, the name of the api name that dp dependent pick list dependent only dp pick list pick list Okay, DP pick list. Okay, object API. Now, what is object API name? What is your object API name? What is object API name? What is your object API name? Account object. So, what is your account API name? If you have a custom object, hota, custom object, you can use underscore underscore C. Dete. That's it. Okay, so account object is account man. Pick list one API name. Subse pehla, unit unit ka API name. Chahiye mujhe. Go back, go to edit object, field and relationship, and search unit. Okay, this is API name, copy, and uh, go to screen flow, just paste, paste the value. Pick list 2 API name, now I need pick list 2 API name. Chahiye. Okay, 2 was the site. Tha. I have copied the site, copy kiya, and paste it. What is the Pick list 1 API name, pick list 2 API name. Okay. Then after this, pick list 1 required. Yes, true. And when you require the required, it will be automatically required. So it will be false. Sorry. Yeah. and pick list one label firstly unit okay and pick list two label where it is pick list two label search pick list two value pick list two label that is site 
so okay i've done from my and sara cheez ho gaya theek hai dp picklist account unit site picklist one label bhi ho gaya required true bhi ho gaya picklist two mein theek 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 ye bhi sara sahi hai okay एडवांस में जाना एंड मैनुअली असाइन वेरिएबल्स एंड पिकलिस्ट वन वैल्यू में क्लिक ऑन न्यू रिसोर्स एंड वेरिएबल टेक कंटेनर वेरिएबल इन दिस वेरिएबल पिकलिस्ट लिस्ट वन टेक्स्ट फिल क्लिक डन and same thing for picklist two value also to select variable pc stick list data type will be text click done click done click save dependent picklist in green flow okay click save and activate this let's check whether it is working fine or not i have to go my home tab and go to setup click on it is edit page search flow drag the component dependent picklist in a screen flow just save it okay go back see when you select the unit audi the side will be opened and it will like audi selier or the kolkata when you select anything else like bharat benz Barovens picklist will be populated. When you select Renault or Toyota, the Toyota, Toyota Delhi, Toyota will be populated. When you select Renault, then Renault will be populated. And when you select Toyota FML, Toyota FML will be values will be populated. So this is how you can use a dependent picklist in a screen flow. Okay, sorry the label name was written something wrong. So don't mind this. Ah, uh, is easily ah. Uh, That's why uh, you use a uh, dependent picklist or unit or site. हमारे पास already मेरे account object में था मैं दिखाता हूँ. Firstly unit, I go to unit object, and in this unit, I have some picklist field. That is this, and same for site also. Okay. I have a picklist this and फील्ड को मैप करने के लिए मैंने फील्ड डिपेंडेंसी पर क्लिक किया था एंड इफ फील्ड डिपेंडेंसी पर मैंने क्लिक ऑन एडिट बटन ये देखो ये डिपेंडेंसी थी ऑडी का ऑडी में जाएगा भारत बंच का भारत बंच रेनॉल्ड का रेनॉल्ड पर इंक्लूड किया था टोटा का टोटा मैंने इंक्लूड किया था एंड टोटा एफ का एफ वाली चीज़ें इंक्लूड किया था एंड सारी चीज़ें करने के बाद मैप करने में इंक्लूड वेरिएबल्स एंड इंक्लूड वेरिएबल्स करने के बाद मैंने सेव किया था और उसके बाद ये ये चीज़ों को मैंने स्क्रीन फ्लो में यूज़ किया था दिस इज और यू कैन यूज द यूज अ डिपेंडेंट पिकलिस इन योर स्क्रीन फ्लो आई होप यू विल लाइक दिस वीडियो प्लीज हिट लाइक एंड सब्सक्राइब माई चैनल एंड स्टे ट्यून फॉर द फ्यूचर अपडेट ऑल्सो इफ यू हैव एनी क्यूरी और डाउट्स प्लीज रोट डाउन इन द कमेंट सेक्शन थैंक यू गाइज